think of all the future soldier programs out there where it's, it's all about the amount of data and information in the battlefield, how do you pull that together? This software is able to integrate all of the information coming from the battlefield and uses holographic technology in order to represent that information in a 3D view. So it's very easy to deconflict fires, especially in complex situations. Because in the modern battlefield, everyone is contributing. So you have artillery, mortars, helicopters, ground troops. And in this way, you have a complete overview, which our brain is very developed to process very easily. It's 18 grams with three cameras, full GPS, um, takes snapshots and HD pictures, and full video. Basically, it's, uh, it's controlled by a single head controller like that. It goes into a soldier's combat vest. The system here, the base station, and the hangars for the helicopters. You have two nano UAVs. They are charged in the hangar. And this is, a, uh, this is a, also a base station, a computer that uh, records everything that the camera in the helicopter records. I can, I can then uh, you know, zoom into the picture and get the details I need. The problem that the current soldier faces is that he has to carry multiple different devices upon his body in order to um, perform his function. All those different devices come with different types of power and different power sources and spare batteries which adds additional burden to that soldier. What we've got is taken all the different power supplies away and put one single power source via a power and data manager that allows the soldier um, to manage the power and data to his different peripherals that he's wearing. There's a saying that uh, ounces equal pounds and pounds equals pain. Uh, so the lighter you can make the equipment, the easier it is for the soldier to complete their mission. The uh, original version of this weighed uh, about 25 and a half pounds. Uh, so we've been able to cut off four and a half pounds of that. We managed also to do other uh, good innovations like in the helmets we managed to do the airbag system like in the car when a car is hit by an accident there is an airbag comes in we have an airbag in the helmet that reduced trauma and impact 